Hi Cancerians, welcome to my channel. We're doing your 15 to the 31st, last two weeks of April. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Let's begin. Sorry if I'm like this. Okay. Well, I, there's a lot of fixing that I need to do. Mm. Okay. There. Okay. Let's begin. All set up. Okay. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. My table is far. Okay, just so that you guys know. Here we go. Ooh, lovers. Hello. Mm-hmm. Let's see, it could be a Gemini Cancerian, which means you have a Mrigashara, no, no, Mrigashara and Radha Punarvasu Nakshatra. Mm -hmm. Here we go, Sun, Moon, Rising, meaning Punarvasu Nakshatra, I feel, hmm, as far as like Jupiterian ruled, you have more chances of winning the lottery than a partner. I'm kidding. <laughs> no, either or. So if you're not winning the lottery, you have more chances of winning a partner. Okay. <laughs> So I'll forget about the partner. Give me that lottery number. I know. <laughs> Here we go. Someone rising Venus and Jupiter. Let's see what's going on for my Gemini. Oh, what? what? Cancerian. 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 Star card. You're probably an in-betweener. That's why. Okay. Star card. Um. See? Winning the lottery. <laughs> Fame. Of course. This can be the person that you're connecting with. Connecting with very famous, okay. Some because the star is like they look at you know they look up to this person. It can be a person who's also um, an inspirational speaker. That's a star card, okay. Um, are just very inspirational and they talk a lot, okay. <laughs> That's a star card. But this can be you also, Cancerian. Um, there's a lot of hope right now that you're having with this person that you're dealing with. Um, a lot of love. A lot of I feel like how to say this. A lot of coming together also with a star card. I'm not gonna go too much. Don't worry because I'm never going to stop with the star card. Okay. <laughs> it's number seven, so partnership, hope. Okay. Let me see. It's good, it's good. I'll be a concern today, I guess. Here we go. Let's see. What? So don't lose hope. Okay. Because <laughs> they left you. Sorry. Eight of Cups. Soul searching. Mm, do you want to have some time? Quiet of my uh, Peace of mind, this person's energy. Okay. So someone is sorting their life, okay? And it's just like, okay, sort of your life. It doesn't mean I'm going to give up on the connection. Okay. I'm lost. I don't know who I am. I don't even know what I want with my life. Eight of Cups. That's that one. Hmm. Okay. I won't give up. The star card. Normally, this is emotional distraught. Okay. Two big words. Oh, my gosh. Two big words. Here we go. Next to the star card. Nine of Cups. Ah! Ha huh, ha huh, ha! Huh. Nine of Cups with the Star card. Okay. More chances of lottery, I'm telling you. Okay. <laughs> Go play the lottery. Getting your wish granted, right? Nine and the Star card. I feel like it's the person. They left you, they come back, and they want to work things out. Mm -hmm. It's not that they did anything wrong. I feel like they're wrong, meaning. They're a person who wasn't ready for you. They're a person who wasn't really a fulfilled being. A person who's empty. Uh, a person who is, you know, it's like it's not, it's not for your best interest at time. That's why they had to go and that's why they had to sort their life. Now here comes Nine of Cups. Let me make you happy, Cancerian. Let me be the person, Nine of Cups. I'm single, I'm ready to love you because you didn't lose hope. You're my only hope mm -hmm. mandy mandy Moore. here we go next to the eight of cups the full card i'm renewed and i'm renewed this is a person who has um has done their shedding so meaning their ashulation of chakra also as far as the cancer leo energy they have shed their skin a new being uh, it can be a new person also but i feel like it's the same person's energy coming towards you but right now, they're, they're finished exploring whatever that they wanted to do, their quiet time, their alone time, their me time. And then now, they want to explore that part of a relationship, the full card. Can you give this another chance? This is this person's actions right now. Take a leap of faith, you know. This is like Aladdin and Jasmine. Do you trust me? You know, this, this person. I trust Ginny because Ginny can give everything. Aladdin, no. <laughs> Jump, you know, this whole Aladdin says, uh-uh, give me genie, give me the lamp. I'll trust you, Aladdin. 
Okay, here we go. <laughs> Prince Ali, fabulous he, Ali Ababa. <laughs> Four of Cups. I miss this person, Sal. If only. If only. There's a lot of ifs with the Four of Cups because this is Debbie Jr. Okay. If only they will come back, Sal. If only they will, you know, ask me for this new beginning. Okay, you're longing. Okay, you're longing for this. But for an eight, okay, double the card, double the energy. Both of you felt the loss. Okay, for some, this is miscarriage. Okay, I'm not sure what happened to your fifth house, but this is miscarriage. Because um, I feel like the star card, you want to have a baby. Sorry for that if you lost a baby. Okay, if you lost a baby, the baby will be found also. I'm just saying, like, you know, I hope you didn't lose your baby like an actual baby. Okay, but I see a baby over here also. Uh huh. Probably a baby we found. Okay. I feel like a four of cups this morning of a loss of a baby. Okay, sorry about that one. Okay. Let me see. Alright, the full card, eight of cups. Knight of swords. Okay, here we go. Here we go. I'm gonna tell you something, Cancerian. Coming fast. Communication out of nowhere. It's known. Okay. This energy is about, okay. Air sign energy. I want to address why I left you. I want to tell you what happened to me while I was gone, and I want to um. I want to come out to you, as someone who you expect me to be, because there's expectation that you have always wanted, and they're coming in towards you to express this. However, with the knight and the full card, they might say good stuff and bad stuff, um, meaning they might say. You know I want a chance with you, but you know that you were such a downer. <laughs> yes, I mean, they tell you something good, they want a chance, but they tell you also what's your defect. Because the knight is just going to be a person who's just like, who has no sense of uh, sensitivity. And that's why Four of Cups is just like, why you can't just talk about the good stuff that we have? You know, that's kind of energy. Because you want this, the star card. But this person has always been... <clears throat> an emotional challenge with you because of the way that they the way that they gonna come out sorry sorry about that one my monitor did okay the way that they want to come out towards you okay hold on let me just okay i'm just gonna close my monitor because this is my tan okay so the way that they oh everything is dying okay <laughs> the way that they want to come out towards you is a little bit um um, not wishy-washy, um, you, you always hope for the best, but they always manage to screw things up. This is this kind of energy, Eight of Cups. The only reason why is the Knight of Swords. That's why they screw up. They don't know how to talk to you in a sensitive way. They don't know how to talk to you the way that will make you happy. But they've always been trying, though, with the Knight of Cups. They've always been trying, always been trying, and always screwing up. The night needs to mature, okay? So I'm going to continue this reading, um, Cancerians, for uh, the last two weeks of April. Link down in the description box for everything that you need. Um, we'll see how they feel towards you, possible outcome, what you need to learn from this, and also if it's going to work out. And, of course, if you guys... Okay, this is um, all Crystal needs. It's linked down there in the description box. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. Bye!